Hi everyone, it's Hannah, and today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. This is not a doll video. Well, clearly. <laughs> I've always wanted to do other videos besides dolls, because I do have a lot of hobbies. And even though I'm not the best at a lot of stuff I do, I just thought it would still be fun to make videos. Maybe you guys want to see, I don't know. Um, oh, actually I'm doing several things different. So first of all, it's a painting video, and second, um, I don't have a script for this audio, <laughs> so I'm just talking, which it's probably going to turn out really bad because I'm not very good at talking, but I'll do my best, so I, I don't know, maybe you guys will like this better than the scripted videos? Probably not, because I'm really awkward, but we'll see. Anyway. Um, oh, one other thing I did differently is the way I set up my camera. It's hopefully better because what I had, oh my gosh, when I was doing my doll videos, I had it set up like kind of weird and I wasn't really able to see what I was doing. So sometimes my head would like block the camera. But this way, like, I have the screen right in front of me. I can see, like, if I'm in the shot or not. So, yeah, I think this is going to end up way better. And I think the quality is better. I'm not sure. Um, so, yeah, I'm not really the greatest at painting. I've only painted a few times before. But I've been drawing basically my whole life. I don't draw as much as I used to. I used to draw all the time, so I'm kind of... I do like Inktober, where I draw like every day of the month, but other than that, it's very like infrequent where I draw, and usually it's just doodles. I don't really put a lot of effort into it, so I really would like to go back into drawing, painting, all that stuff. And I think this painting actually turned out pretty good. I was surprised. I mean, I messed up a few times, like you saw before, <laughs> like I went over the the hair clips and I was like, oops. So I just like painted over it and I'm like, I'll go back and fix that. That's what's great about paint. You can just like go over the paint with more paint. <laughs> I've only painted a few times before and I've always used Actually, I take that back. I take that back. I've done quite a bit of watercolor paintings, which I am not good at. I mean, I'm trying, but I always have either too much water in my brush, not enough water, or I don't know. It just turns out really bad. Acrylic painting, I've only done a few times, and they've turned out okay. This is definitely my favorite that I've done. <laughs> um... And I've never done oil painting. I've never done gouache or whatever it's called. <laughs> so yeah, I would like to try that though. The subject matter of this painting doesn't really mean anything. I just like to draw cute girls. I'm very used to drawing faces. That's what I'm best at. I'm kind of suck at bodies, <laughs> but I do need to practice that more, so I will try, and especially hands, I'm really bad at hands, but faces I can do, which is why I love doll customization so much, because I basically am just drawing on a face, and uh, that's what I'm pretty good at. Um, I also wanted to do pastel colors, but I put down this really... Uh, that ye- oh my gosh, the yellow is just- I'm just looking at it right now and it's so bad. So I go over that later with another shade of pink, which is a lot better because I don't know what's going on. Oh, it was like straight out of the tube yellow and that was just bad. Not sure what I was thinking, but I'm doing an outline in white to make it pop. And I'm also doing it like a Instagram post, so I just thought that would be cool. And I used tape at the bottom so that I don't get... <laughs> I'm so bad at explaining. So that I don't get paint in that area. And I can just rip it off and it's so satisfying 
when it's like a clean line, which it was pretty much a clean line. Like it, some kind of went through, but not through. <laughs> some kind of got in the wrong area, but it's okay. I want to apologize if you hear some kind of like tapping noise with my mic. I kind of have a cheap mic. It's not the best. It picks up every little sound. So definitely need a new one. So I'm going to save up for one for sure. I recently just got a light box for my dolls. So now my thumbnails are going to be so much better. And just my photography in general is going to be so much better. I used to just open a the blinds of a window and like set it against my wall it was really ugly or I'd like tape a piece of paper behind the doll <laughs> it was not it was not good uh, what was that noise I just made I am so sorry this I think this, <laughs> this no script audio is not going so well <laughs> Anyway, I would like to paint more and make more videos of non-doll activities <laughs> because I think I said this before, I do have a lot of hobbies. Did I say this before? I don't even know. I don't even know what I've said anymore. But yeah, I do have a, <laughs> I have a lot of hobbies. I'm not an expert at any of them. <laughs> I think I would say I'm best at doll customization. Um... But I've done all sorts of stuff. I do needle felting, painting, drawing. I do digital art too. I've tried knitting. I do scrapbooking. I do sewing like full size clothes sometimes. I used to be really into cosplay so I would actually make clothes for humans. <laughs> Which I don't really like. I definitely prefer just making clothes for dolls because you don't need as much fabric and it's really cute how tiny it is. Um, what else do I do? I, I don't even know, but <laughs> I really enjoyed painting this and I don't know if anyone's even going to be interested in watching this, but I like it and I enjoyed doing it a lot and even though this video is kind of a mess with the audio, it's still fun. Did I say that already? I don't even know what I'm saying. See, this is why I need a script. Oh my gosh. Um, the point that I'm trying to make is that painting really helps me and it's fun. Fun, fun, fun. Wow, I'm saying that a lot. I have a lot of anxiety, so <laughs> pay to is really good for me i would say oh here here we go I'm, I'm ripping the tape off Ooh, that is so cool oh my gosh that's <laughs> so cool okay so anxiety yeah oh my gosh i've i've had anxiety since i was two and a half years old so fun times fun times art has always been a kind of escape from me, from my mind. <laughs> that sounds really emo, but it's true. Um, I've always really, lo really loved art ever since I could pick up a pencil or a crayon or, or a marker. I have drawn, I have made stories. I just love, 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 love art. And I'm so thankful for all the support that I've been getting from you guys. You guys are just amazing, so kind, and you make me want to do more art and videos, and you guys just make me happy. <laughs> so here is my painting all finished. I just need to add some gloss varnish, and I'm done. I think it turned out pretty good for someone that doesn't paint all that much. I definitely need more practice. But yeah, I would like to do more and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. As always, goodbye.